Assalamu alaikum. KidsWillBeKids.org presents Midnight Snack. It's late at night and I'm still awake. I have a craving to eat some chocolate cake. I've already tried counting some sheep, but even that hasn't helped me fall asleep. Perhaps I should just go to the kitchen and get a little peace. Maybe then I'll be able to sleep in peace. Mom baked the cake today. Alhamdulillah, it was yummy. She said don't eat too much. It's not good for your tummy. But I finished all my dinner, so Mom can't complain. I just want I just want a little more dessert. It's not hard to explain. The kitchen seems far away from my dark bedroom up to here. Across the hall and down the stairs. Well, that's nothing to fear. I make my decision. I'm going for the cake. Creeping through this dark house is a risk I'm willing to take. Bismillah, I open my door slowly. It gives out a soft creak. I slip out my room, then down the hall I sneak. I move very quietly, trying not to make a sound, and keep checking behind to make sure no one is around. Creeping around in the dark does look suspicious, but I just want some cake. SubhanAllah, it's so delicious. I approach my parents' room on my tippy toe, silently floating by like a ghostly shadow. I can hear my parents snoring like a pair of large bears. Ever so silently, I make my way downstairs. Watching me from the bottom are two glowing eyes. It's just my cat. It's no big surprise. Don't make a sound, I say, petting him with my hands. He's just a cat, but I hope he'll understand. All that's left is to cross the hallway floor, which is quite cold. It's better to finish the cake now, I think, before it gets old. As I near the kitchen, the chocolate smell is in the air. Inshallah, I'll just have a few pieces. I'm sure no one will care. Sneaking around in the dark house to get some cake has been fun. I turn on the kitchen light and... It's all done! <laughs> Inna lillah.